Good day YouTube. Today I'm doing just a bit of a quick fun comparison video between Fedora 36 on the left hand side versus OpenSUSE uh, version 2022 on the right hand side here. So they are actually both running on the XFCE desktop environment as part of a continuing series of videos I'm doing at the moment here. So let's take a bit of an in-depth look or at least a little tiny look, I should say, here at the um, at the differences and similarities here. So XFCE. Now on the left hand side for Fedora 36 FC XFCE edition, we are running on a bit of a stock standard uh, desktop environment for it here. So we do have categorization for each of the apps, internet, multimedia, office, that sort of thing. But that's pretty much it. Uh, we don't really have any uh, search menu like on the right hand side here for OpenSUSE. So we do still have the categories, which look just beautiful, but uh, we actually do of course have the ability to to type and search for something which I tend to like anybody really tends to like or make it in right click on the uh, desktop and this is all pretty much the same here slightly customized looks a little bit different on the uh, OpenSUSE side versus Fedora but it is what it is if we open the file manager we usually find that the de facto standard for uh, the uh, XFCE desktop environment is the Thuna file manager there pretty much uh, much of a muchness there really there's no real differences we can really see I just like to right click and open up a terminal and away you go uh, let's see in the the back end a little bit uh, let's see what's going on here so if I can just load up this stuff here and here we go so Fedora running on the 5.17 kernel you could say latest and greatest open to say not not too far behind at the uh, 5.16 kernel so either one is pretty much fine for any uh, later hardware that you might be using you know be it graphics cards, CPU, microcode, Wi-Fi cards, all sorts of things. Last but not least, uh, take this section with a bit of a grain of salt, but uh, let's look at the CPU and RAM usage on boot up. So pretty much idling off there for both of them on the CPU side of things. So we are running at 580 megabytes of RAM on boot up for Fedora, uh, whereas for OpenSUSE, we are running at 532 megabytes of RAM. So a good 50 megabytes less. So that, that's not too bad. Uh, it's not going to change. It's not world changing, but it is what it is. So thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one.